it today. Something special came in the mail today. It's the Verum Pet Fitness. It's a smart robot for your pets. It's it's from a uh, from a campaign from Indiegogo, which I signed up for at the end of last year. Um, it was supposed to come in January, but I guess they delayed it a little bit to have some improvements, and so it's finally here. So we're excited. It's for our little dog Ollie, who's a beagle. Um, so here's the device. It's a little smart robot that uh, you can use uh, with your smartphone to help uh, keep your pet occupied. It kind of moves around the floor, your dog can chase it, it also dispenses treats. Uh, inside the box is also a couple of attachments here that, were, that uh, we were updated on. I guess they wanted to improve the integrity of the, of the robots. They've had this plastic case here that goes around it to help protect it a little bit better. I guess some dogs are a little bit stronger chewers, like our dog which is helpful. There's a little dispensing case here that holds the treats. It's for your uh, the dog, so there's a small version of this one. Um, there's a little attachment here for, it's a cat accessory, it comes with like a little tail here for the, them to play. Like I said, we have a dog, but I'm sure our dog will enjoy this just as much. I might, I might destroy that one. Uh, there's a little back um, attachment. I think this is just a more reinforced back part. I think I remember mentions, mentioning something about improving that. And we have the tires uh, for the robots. It helps give it traction on the floor so it can move around, or maybe you know, your dog might bite it, it might be worn away. So it's nice to have some additional replacements. So I was actually wasn't expecting that. And sponsored treats from Crazy Dog. So I guess this is what they're suggesting. So. Let's open up the box and take a little look. So that opens up. All right. So here's the device. It's a good size. Look at that. Nice little size. We have a beagle, about 28, 29 pounds. So I think this will be well for him. There's a lot of energy. So it spins on these wheels here. So it goes on the, on the ground and spins on the wheels. Um, this is where the treats are dispensed. I believe this is a sensor and a little screen here to give you the, tell you the settings. Here's the back. I think this is where that little attachment goes to. So I'm excited to put this together. Um, let's, let's, I'm gonna stop the video really quick, just install it, and we'll come back to it and see how it uh, performs with our dog, Ollie. All right, so I spent a couple minutes trying to get familiar with the robot a little bit more. This is Ollie. This is who the robot's for. He's in a little tri-colored beagle here um, so he hasn't played with it yet I'm still trying to get it all figured out but um, I uh, took the time and I installed the app and I kind of put it all together it comes with this cool little tool here to help you open up the back where you can get started with it so um, I understand now why they provided this one because it's very difficult to put in Ollie's already excited to to go in there so if you pop this back here a little bit it should open up the it's a little difficult to be honest. Um, it comes with, there's an on and off switch here. And what I didn't get to show you guys earlier was uh, it, the box actually comes with some cables here. I'm always more excited about that one. It comes with some cables here, which you plug into the wall to get it installed. Um, so you plug that into the wall here. There's another compartment here, which opens up, which has the treats. Um, so on the app here, you go to the app store and there's an app called Verum. Um, and you open that up and it, you install the whole process, you, register, you go through the registrations of it, and it allows you to now have access and allow you to control the device. So I'm gonna turn on the app a little bit, you can see the lights come on. Yeah, and then you, you say you wanna play with it manually. Let's go through all the steps here. And you can control it going front and back, just by moving that. So forward, backwards, side, and other side. So, they provide us with this little, let me put this back in, they provide us with this little protective case, um, just to protect the device. I think we'll definitely be using this one because our little beagle is a very excited little dog and I don't want him to destroy this. <laughs> so I believe it goes like that, snaps in place, just like that. Oh, maybe I didn't get that in there. Okay. There you go, just like that. So it's in place right now. And they have different settings. I've, I haven't really had a chance to play with it yet, but you can do um, automatic settings like swing, waltz, slow spin, wiggle, 
treat sounds. I haven't put the treats in yet just because I wanted them. I just wanted to get used to it first. And you can also do it just manually just by going front and backwards. So we can chase around the house. If it happens to tumble over, it'll, I'm sure it will, let's see. I'm sure it'll figure its way out eventually. Um, and the treats will come out here. Um, so yeah, we're excited to do, to play with this. It comes with also managed schedule. I believe you can set a schedule for a specific part of the day. Um, I think for your dogs, if they're not as excited or um, you could uh, set a schedule. You can, when you're out of the house, it will automatically turn on so your dog has some play time while you're out of the house. But in our case, I think we'll keep, we'll, we, we'll be supervising Ollie at all times during this one. Um, and that's pretty much it. I'm excited for Ollie to give it a try. I'll try in the, um, the next video, we'll introduce it. All right, so we're gonna give this um, robot a first try with Ollie. Um, I've noticed that the blue lights turn on whenever you uh, touch the device. So if Ollie wanted to play with it and we're, and we're away from it and he wanted to play with it, it can turn on automatically. So I'm gonna put this on the ground here. I'm gonna get used to it a little bit first. Hopefully it'll play nice. Oh boy, let's see if I can control it. <laughs> this is for connect. Controls are pretty simple. <laughs> He's just trying to figure out what it's doing. What's it doing? I like that there's nothing really much for him to grab onto. Oh, look, it just flipped over. Let's see if it'll come back on its own. There we go. I like how there's nothing for him to grab onto because he has a tendency to grab onto things and drag it and drop it. So maybe with this one, it'll be it'll just be able to play it on the floor. Um, I'm gonna try some of the the settings here. So I'm gonna put it back in its normal state. So far, he's doing well with it. I'm gonna try maybe swing. Let's see what that swing does. Holly, what's that? That's swinging. <laughs> I think he's a little nervous about it. Um, there's waltz. These are automatic settings, so. It's like a little dance there. There is a slow spin. Oh, well, he's interrupting the process, but. <laughs> there's wiggle. I think he's confused. I think once we introduce the treats, then we'll get a little more excited about it. Um, there's treat sound. Well, let's just, let's just shake first. A little shake. There's a 80, 180 degree turn. And there's turnover. So I guess if it flips upside down, which is, it is right now, let's see if it can fix itself. Almost. Oh, you can do it. There you go. Um, there's also a turbo, which I'm not really sure what it's turbo. I guess it works double the speed. It's double. There's waltz again. Hmm. Okay, I guess there's also some sounds. I'm not really sure. I didn't really hear much. Oh, there's a sound. I need to turn it on. Interesting. Um, I guess you also can control the color of the eye of it. Right now it's blue, sky blue. So I think we'll keep it sky blue. I like sky blue. All right, Ollie, what do you think? Come here. Come here, pups. What do you think? I guess he, I guess once we get the treats involved, he's a little bit more excited about it. Um, but yeah, that's nice. I think it'll be fun for Ollie to get used to and play with. And um, we'll see. I'll keep you guys updated on how it goes. But it looks fun to me. Thanks. Nice.